Today, I'm going to show you guys the most profitable CS2 trade-ups for every budget. In these storage units, I have 12 insane trade-ups. Two for every budget ranging from $1 all the way up to $100. So no matter how much money you have to work with, at least one of these trade-ups will be perfect for you. By the way, I'm giving away this factory new Bowie knife freehand when we hit 30,000 subscribers. So if you'd like to enter for a chance to win that, check out the community post. I'll leave a link to that in the description below. Also, make sure to stick around and watch the whole video to find out what this week's giveaway is in the instructions to enter. Let's Let's start with the $1 trade-ups. The first trade-up consists of 10 field-tested mil-spec skins from the Revolution case below a .1875 average float. Make sure to get each skin for 7 cents or less. This trade-up costs 70 cents total and has a 130% profitability after steam fees, with an 80% chance to profit each time. Of the 4 profit outcomes, the best is the Minimal Wear m 4 Asaurus at just over 70 cents of profit. Alright boys, first trade-up of the video, the absolute cheapest one, this one's only going to cost you around 70 cents. Let's start it off with a bang right here show us the m4 saurus three two one profit let's go third best option 25 cents of profit great way to start it off go try this trade up out for yourself and before i show you guys the second one dollar trade up here's a quick word from today's sponsor today's sponsor gamer pay wants to sponsor you with a free five euros on your first 50 euro deposit gamer pay is an extremely trustworthy peer-to-peer -peer skin trading website where you can find some of the cheapest cs2 skins on the market take a look at this mac 10 fade for example currently the cheapest one is on gamer pay gamer pay has no buying fee and only a small three percent selling fee and you can even sell your skins on a trade lock what are you waiting for for. Click the link in the description to claim your free 5 euros today. The second $1 trade-up consists of 10 minimal wear mil spec skins from the CS20 case below a .0875 average float. Make sure to get each input for 15 cents or less. This trade-up costs $1.50 total and has a 111.33% profitability after steam fees with an 80% chance to profit each time. Of the four profit outcomes, the best is the factory new P250 Inferno at $1 of profit. Alright boys, second trade-up of the video. This one's only going to cost you around $1.50, so this one's a banger. 80% chance to profit again, and if we hit that P250, 250 we're making a dollar of profit let's see it right here show us the p250 oh that's okay though 12 cents of profit we're still profiting cannot be upset and honestly bro this m249 is kind of clean i've never noticed that before super nice engravings with the moss coming in on it pretty nice skin now let's move on to the five dollar price range the next trade-up consists of 10 stat track minimal wear mil spec skins from the dreams and nightmares case below a 0 0.0921 average float make sure to get each input for 28 cents or less this trade-up costs two dollars and 80 cents total and has a 136.43 percent profitability after steam fees with a 40 percent chance to profit each time. The best outcomes here are the USPS and M4A1S, each at just under $4 of profit. Third trade up of the video, this one's coming in at just under $3. First stat track one as well. This one's actually only a 40% chance to profit, but two of those non-profit outcomes are pretty much break even, only losing you around 30 cents each. But we do want to see the USPS ticket to hell or the M4A1S night terror. Show us one of those. Three, two, one, boom. Uh. Not great, but the best loss option, if you know what I mean. Only 27 cents of loss, pretty much breaking even. Can't be too upset with that, but we would have loved to see over $3 of profit there. The next trade-up consists of one factory new and nine field-tested mil-spec skins from the Dust 2 collection below a 0.175 average float. The easiest way to do this is by getting the factory new skin below a 0.021 float and the minimal wear skins each below a 0.1921 float. Make sure to get the factory new skins for $1.22 or less and each of the field-tested skins for $0.53 cents or less. This trade costs $5.99 total and has a 131.72% profitability after steam fees with a 100% chance to profit each time. There's only one outcome here, so you're guaranteed to make $1.90 every time. All right, boys, I absolutely love this second $5 contract we have here. It's a guaranteed profit. There's only one outcome. It's the P2000 Amber Fade for nearly $2 of profit every single time you click. Ready for this? Three, two, one, $2. I'll take that any day of the week. If you can find the skins, why not do it? It's free money, man. Now we're moving on to the $10 trade-ups. The first trade-up from this price range consists of four Stat Trek Factory new mil-spec skins from the Glove Case and six Stat Trek Minimal Wear mil-spec skins from the Prisma Case below a 0 .07 average float. The easiest way to do this is by getting the Factory new Glove skins under a 0.4 float and the Minimal Wear Prisma skins under a 0 .09 float. Make sure to get the Glove inputs for $1.11 or less and the Prisma inputs for $0.89 or less. This trade-up costs $9.78 
$0.99 total and has a 108.9% profitability after Steam fees with a 40% chance to profit each time. There are four profitable outcomes with the best easily being the Stat Trek Factory new Apotheris at nearly $30 of profit. It is only a 40% chance to profit, but one of those outcomes is for nearly $30 of profit. I've done this contract on my own many times, but I've never hit the Apotheris. Can we do it right here? I've hit the light rail so many times, so I'm honestly expecting that again. But let's see it. Show us the op. Three, two, one, up. Oh. I low-key got baited. I saw the sniper-looking silhouette and thought it was the op, but that was a pretty terrible outcome. I think that might actually be the worst option. Nearly a $7 loss. Not the best, obviously. The next trade-up consists of 10 Stat Track Minimal Wear Restricted Skins from the glove case below a 0 .0933 average float. Make sure to get each input for $1.50 or less. This trade-up costs $15 total and has a 118.67% profitability after Steam fees, with a 100% chance to profit each time. Every outcome is great but the Stat Track Factory new FAMAS Mecha Industries is the best at over $5 of profit. What will this second $10 trade up bring us? It's a 100% chance to profit, so no matter what we're winning, but I would love to see the Mecha Industries right here. Please show us the Mecha Industries. Three, two, one. Boom. Uh, not bad though, $2 and 30 something cents of profit. We will take that. And as I've said before, I actually do think this is a slept on skin, man. Kind of clean. Now let's officially move on to the $25 trade ups. The first $25 trade up consists of four Stat Trek Factory new restricted skins from the Snake Bite case and six Stat Trek Minimal Wear restricted skins from the Chroma 2 case below a 0 0.0625 average float. The easiest way to do this is by getting the Snake Bite skins below a 0 0.025 float and the Chroma 2 skins below a 0 0.0875 float. Make sure to get the Snake Bite skins for $3.08 or less, and the Chroma 2 skins for $2.05 or less. This trade up costs $24.62 total and has a 137.9% profitability after Steam fees, with a 73.33% chance to profit each time. Of the four profitable outcomes, the Galil Eco is easily the best at just under $40 of profit. Alright boys, the first $25 trade up. This one is honestly one of my absolute favorites from this whole video. There's very little risk with a chance of very high rewards here. Also, I'm just noticing Noticing this skin right here. Whoever put this name tag on is a man of good taste. If you know, you know. Let's see what we get. Show us the Galil Eco. Three, two, one, boom. Uh, that's literally the worst outcome. $2.17 loss. I mean, can't be that upset. It's not a crazy loss. Like I said, there's not much risk with this trade up, but we would have loved to see that nearly $40 profit on the eco. GG's. Let's move on to the second $25 trade up. The next trade up consists of six Stat Track Factory new restricted skins from the Danger Zone case and four Stat Track field tested restricted skins from the Kilowatt case below a 0 0.098 average float. The easiest way to do this is by getting the Danger Zone skins below a 0 0.03 float and the Kilowatt Kilowatt skins below a 0.2 float. Make sure to get the Danger Zone skins for $3.48 or less, and the Kilowatt skins for $4.29 or less. This trade up costs $38.04 total and has a 114.56% profitability after Steam fees, with a 40% chance to profit each time. Each of the Kilowatt skins are profitable, with the best being the Stat Trek Factory new M4A1S Black Lotus at over $75 of profit. Alright, boys, this is one I've definitely been excited for. This is the first trade up I've been doing that includes any Kilowatt skins. I know, I know. There's a lot of money to be made in kilowatts. I've just been super busy, so I haven't been spamming them out like some others, but I am excited nonetheless. Let's see it here. Show us the M4A1S Black Lotus for over $78 of profit. Oh, and I do want to mention, I know this is a bit more of an expensive trade-up coming in at around $38, but it's still in that $25 or so dollar price range, so don't beat me up in the comments. All right, let's see it here. 40% chance at hitting the kilowatt case. Three, two, one boom let's go we will take that it's only a 13 dollars profit we could have hit the zeus or the black lotus for more but it is a profit nonetheless we are taking that w skin right here i really like this actually all right boys this week i'm giving away a minimal wear ak-47 nightwish to enter make sure to like this video subscribe to my channel and leave a comment letting me know what your favorite trade up from today's video is so far also just make sure to have your steam trade link in your youtube bio so i can send you the skin when you win but make sure you don't skip a step or else you won't be entered now let's move on to the 50 dollars trade 
trade-ups. The first $50 trade-up consists of 10 StatTrack field-tested classified skins from the Revolution case below a 0.1875 average float. Make sure to get each input for $4.49 or less. This trade-up costs $44.90 total and has a 160.56% profitability after Steam fees, with a 50% chance to profit each time. The M4A4 Temu Cow is the only profitable outcome here at over $60 of profit, but the AK Headshot isn't even that bad, only losing you around $8. Alright boys, this is where things really start to get interesting. This is a 45 or so dollar trade up right here. And oh my, I have done so many Temu Cow trade ups before and I haven't hit it once. I always without fail hit the headshot. So please let this be the first time I see the Temu Cow. Show me the stat track minimal wear M4A4 Temu Cow for 60 something dollars of profit in three two one temu cow <laughs> bro i think that's like 10 for 10 headshots i swear there's skewed odds toward the headshot like there must be man i've done so many of these it's starting to ah! hurt me it's starting to weigh down on my soul but let's move on to the second 50 dollar trade-up the next trade-up consists of one stat track minimal wear and nine stat track field tested classified skins from the recoil case below a 0.17642 average float the easiest way to do this is by getting the minimal wear skin below a 0.0875 float and the field tested skins each below a 0.1863 float. Make sure to get the minimal wear skin for $10.23 or less and the field tested skins for $5.16 or less. This trade-up costs $56.67 total and has a 123.24% profitability after Steam fees with a 50% chance to profit each time. The StatTrack minimal wear USPS print stream is the only profit outcome here at over $50 of profit. All right, boys, we missed the first 50-50. So hopefully that means we'll hit this one right here. Show us the print stream for $55 five dollars of profit right now three two one print stream brother what is this luck honestly you know what i hope this just means we're hitting both of the 100 dollars trade-ups gaben show us the luck the first 100 dollars trade-up consists of 10 factory new classified skins from the danger zone case below a 0.0307 average float make sure to get each input for nine dollars and 48 cents or less this trade-up costs 94 dollars and 80 cents total and has a 128.59 percent profitability after steam fees with a 50 percent chance to profit each time the factory new ak-47 awesome mob is the only only profitable outcome at over $110 of profit. I have done this trade up time and time again. If you've seen my Nothing to a Knife series, you know this is one of my most hated. I think I've only succeeded on it one time. Gaben, I need you to allow today to be the second time. Show us the factory new Aussie mom. Three, two, one, boom! Brother, what is my luck right now? I've failed three 50-50s in a row. Like, no thank you, brother. I'm not enjoying this here. We need to hit the last trade up. We absolutely need to. The final trade up of this video consists of 10 Stat Trek minimal wear classified skins from the Horizon case below a 0.0875 average float. Make sure to get each input for $14.24 or less. This trade up costs $142.40 total and has a 141.57% profitability after Steam fees with a 50% chance to profit each time. The Stat Trek factory new AK 47 Neon Rider is the only profitable outcome here at nearly 200 dollars of profit and in classic widdly fashion all comes down to the final trade-up we've missed three 50 50s in a row this has not been a great episode for profit but this hit right here would help us out a ton show me my favorite ak skin in the entire game the stat track factory new ak-47 neon rider right now three two one bro <laughs> I don't even like know what to say. Four 50-50 misses in a row? Like that is insane. Well, hopefully this means I'm saving my luck for the nothing to glove series because technically this video doesn't mean much. It is just showing you guys some sick trade ups, but wow, am I down. That is not good. At the very least, I hope my lack of luck means that when you guys try these out for yourselves, you'll get lucky. Since I missed all of that, please at the very least, just drop a like on this video if you enjoyed it. It will help 
help me out a lot. Let me quickly do some calculations, even though I know it's going to be heavily in the negative. All right, boys, as you can see, these are the 12 skins we came out with. Don't get me wrong, some very nice skins, but our bank account did not enjoy that. This may have been the most abysmal and least profitable video I've ever recorded. After doing the calculations, it looks like I lost $158.16 on these trade-ups. Obviously, the whole point of trade-ups is that if you do a bunch of them, on average, you'll be profiting. So it's kind of risky if you're just doing one of each. Sometimes you won't be making money, but there's nothing we can do about that. Hopefully that just means the next video I record, I'll have much more luck. Drop a like, please. And as always, thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed this video, YouTube thinks you'll like this one too. Oh yeah, and YouTube told me 75% of you aren't subscribed yet. So go thumb wrestle that subscribe button down below.